So, this is day 25, and um, it's day 25 of the intense journey. Uh, frustrating day, and when I get frustrated, I realize I eat. So I ate today, and I ate stuff I shouldn't have ate, and uh, kind of mad at myself right now because I have been killing it. So as I talk to you, I'm working through that anger. I, you know what? I'm not. It's not mad. I'm, fr I'm disappointed in myself because I hold myself to a higher standard, and I've been doing so good on this and making good choices. But I let my emotions get to me today. A little frustrated. So day 25, the intense journey. And I will be honest with you, there was part of me that did not want to post this video and didn't want to make a video because I felt like a failure at my goals because, um, yeah ate crappy today. Whenever I get upset, I turn to carbs. Yeah, lots of them. Yeah. But, that's over, and tomorrow is a new day. I am going to go home. I will either swim my pool or I will um, take a walk do something active um, so the intense journey I guess wasn't so intense today because I totally flubbed this one totally flubbed it so I've got to find a better way to manage my emotions actually I've been doing good with managing my emotions things have been really good even with challenges you know, we got another truck, so I'm happy about that. We got two chippers out of the shop. Happy about that. Getting the equipment we need. Um, but I think I go from these extreme highs, and then when things don't go my way the next day, it hits a low because I'm already, like, all emotional and stuff and feeling like things are finally going in the way I want them to. And so when I hit a spot where they don't, it goes down. It start, And actually, it started off early this morning. My internet was not working right, and I was trying to do our show and we didn't get a chance to shoot our show because my internet wasn't working right then I got a, a call from a relative that was you know crazy stuff with that I'm not gonna get into that because they listen to our show and I just want to honor that and respect their privacy and um, I kept trying to get back on the train the, the positive train the I'm a motivated train. I got this train. And I would have sparks of that. But by the end of the day, when things did not exactly go the way I wanted to, as far as... I'll tell you what happened. I actually um, bought a truck yesterday. Yay! And I'll, I'll take a picture of it um, and uh, send it to you guys. Or I'll post, it, I'll post something about it. Yeah. So actually, it's a lease. Um, and then I'm going to purchase it. I'm going to keep it for a while and then purchase it. Um, because I do have two other trucks coming and I didn't want to spend a whole bunch of money. Which I did spend a bunch of money on it. But I also wanted to make sure it was structured in such a way that it worked for my finances right now. So I went ahead and, and um, got that. And it's a brand new truck. Never been used by nobody but me. So that felt really, 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 really good. Let me tell you something. This is what happens when you don't eat healthy. Your brain doesn't work right. Now, I can stop this video right now and go back to what I was getting ready to say. But I probably can't remember what I was getting ready to say because I didn't eat right, so my brain's not working right. So I don't know what I was getting ready to say to you. But I know I said something about a truck. I know I said something about eating healthier or whatever. I forget. Day 25. Day 25 is going to go down as an interesting one. This is not probably not one of my best videos. But it's honest. I will say something else that I am frustrated about, which I don't know if this is 
um, a big deal, but to me it's a big deal. I am really frustrated with the fact that every day I'm starting to hear in the news more and more information about people's immune system, about health, about vitamin D. I'm hearing doc doctors talking about exercise and doctors talking about drinking water and doctors talking about getting some sun and doctors talking about studies talking about how vitamin D affects your immune system and all this kind of stuff. Here's the thing that pisses me off about this. People have known about this for years. The medical community has known about this for years. I was in a uh, network marketing company called Equinox and I learned a lot about health and nutrition in that company. Granted, there were some things that weren't so great about that company, but there was a lot that I did learn. And I learned about vitamins, minerals, nutrition, and stuff like that. And the thing that pisses me off is I've got people that I care about, that I love, that I'm that I just absolutely adore that are not taking this thing with your immune system and vitamin D and minerals and turmeric and, and keeping your your digestive system intact and and eating clean, which I ate dirty today, but anyway. But anyway, so I talk about this stuff. Other people talk about this stuff, other knowledgeable people, and they make it sound like it's some cuckoo stuff, like the, the people are that aren't as aware or, or that just think it's funny, but yet they'll take the word of somebody that wants to pump your body full of drugs, pump your body full of, um, yeah, all kind of chemicals and stuff come out with a vaccine that we don't even know what the heck that is. But anyway, we've got to find a way to COVID, fight this COVID thing, which we are, but one of the best things we could do is keep our bodies healthy and take our vitamins and minerals, specifically vitamin D. So that way, if you do get this thing, your immune system can actually fight it and be in better, a better situation. But people think it's funny. And now Joe Rogan has one of the biggest podcasts out there. Do you know what he's doing right now? I, I am literally watching a podcast of, of his or listening to it where he's talking with a doctor or I, I don't know if she's a doctor, but she's a trainer or something in the, in, um, in a, a scientist talking about vitamin D. Now, I've been talking about this for months. Other people have been talking about it. Other alternative doctors and medical people have been talking about it. Scientists have been talking about it. And it totally makes sense. It totally makes sense. But you know what? We're going to keep people scared and inside, not getting any sun, not taking their supplements, and people are going to continue to die. And it should be criminal, but it's not criminal because you know what? People are doing it to themselves. Put a mask on, go outside, get some sun, get a vitamin D supplement, drink tons of water, and stay away from crappy food. I'm talking to myself now. Stay away from crappy food. And eat lots of leafy green vegetables. That was the other thing she was talking about. Eat lots of leafy green vegetables. Yeah. People just dying for no reason. Dying. Because you don't want to take a supplement and go outside, drink water, and eat some vegetables. Just dying. And it's not criminal. It makes me sick. But you know what? I just need to not care so much. That's what it is. This is going to be a long ass video. I just need to not care so much. Because you know what? If somebody tells you to eat some freaking vegetables and stop eating junky food and drink tons of water and take a vitamin D supplement, get some B12, and you'd rather not do that than die. That's where I'm at with this. Because none of this stuff is a secret. Just like none of the stuff to building a life and a successful business is a secret. And guess what? I had to pay the price. I did stupid stuff. I made stupid mistakes. I made stupid choices. I had toxic people around me and I had to pay the price. So guess what? I guess that's what everybody is going to have to do. Instead of learning from each other's mistakes and making better choices, we're just going to throw up our hands and not learn from the people that came before us or the people who've had past experience with certain things and can teach us. Let's just keep winging it. 
Let's listen to the news. Because why read a book on nutrition? Why drink some water? Why eat some vegetables? Why cut meat products? Or I eat some meat now. I mean, well, like fish and stuff like that. So, but primarily vegetarian, pescatarian. Yeah. Why? But why eat healthy? Just do what you want to do. Die. Yeah, that's the mood I'm in. Day 25 is pretty intense. But not for the reasons you think. People are going to die. Yeah. So basically what I'm saying, whether you want to believe me or not, is you cut crappy food out of your diet. Eat some vegetables. Drink a ton of water. Eat leafy green vegetables. Take a vitamin D3 supplement every freaking day. And some B12. Yeah. You can raise your immune system and not have to die from this stuff. Ooh. But is it scientifically proven? Yes, it's scientifically proven. But don't believe me. Do what you want to do. All right. I got to go. Because I'm in that kind of a mood. Bye.